If I ask you to close your eyes and envision a world destroyed by climate change, terrifying images may come to mind. Floods, fires, hurricanes, refugee crises. But what if I ask you to close your eyes and picture a world where we've solved climate change? What do you see? This world's harder to picture, largely because it involves myriad possible climate futures. My personal favorite climate future closes central Philadelphia to car traffic, but enables clean air travel, so we don't lose the joy of cross-cultural connection. It also spreads well-paid work across more people and limits the length of the work week, thus nurturing non-material modes of affluence. Your climate future probably strikes a different balance. Maybe it involves nuclear energy instead of offshore wind to preserve marine environments. Maybe veganism and animal welfare are critical. Maybe you'll sacrifice house square footage, but never your freedom on the open road. The point is this, we need to think and talk much more about what we want our climate future to look like. Climate change requires such significant infrastructural and social change that it allows us to tackle a host of other issues, from inequality to land use in the built environment to our modes of living together in community. We need to articulate affirmative visions of how solving climate change can make life better. Then we need dialogue and democracy to help us choose among those possible climate futures. Let me close by getting more concrete. In August, the United States passed the Inflation Reduction Act, arguably the largest climate bill in our history. Its main strategy is to funnel money towards clean energy projects at multiple scales, thus financing more than shaping the clean energy future. It is now up to each of us to participate in city and state governments, in energy commissions, in electricity cooperatives, and universities as we collectively struggle to build a future that's grounded in something more joyful and worthwhile than fossil fuels or an outpost on Mars. So imagine, and then discuss, vote, organize, speak, and build.